Hey guys, Flexors here, and today I'm going to show you that draft video that I promised. So this was a Kaldheim Premier draft, turns out we went 7-2. No one actually had the prediction, so I'm going to figure something else out to do with the code. Also, these are just a couple of highlights uh, from the draft. This is not the full draft. This will be uploaded later to my YouTube, so you can check that out as well. I hope you enjoy, and I'll catch you next time. I don't know if it's the right choice or the wrong one. Pretty sure we're gonna find that soon enough. Uh, playing this for gr uh, no 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 no. <laughs> I learned from my previous mistake. We're playing the swamp for the dusk wheel there. Fortel. Well, since we got double pack mate, probably gonna have to foretell a pack mate. And hit for one. Scorn Effigy. Okay, that's a 2-3. And foretell something else. I did find the land. So probably just playing Packmate, keeping up village rights. Could be a good answer to a removal. And we did find another land. Not attacking here. Boasting one time here. Not really worth it losing the creature over. I've never really played with Scorn Effigy, actually. Okay. So let's block. So they're gonna Mammoth Grove. Yeah, let's get some value from that pack, mate. Elderleaf Mentor and Harald. You know... Raise the Draugr is looking quite interesting with both pack mates in my hand. And honestly, I think it's better to play pack mate. I'm actually thinking, is there a two mana counter spell? No, uh, no attacks. I can't boast, so... Do they have mists? Yes, they have mists of Lityara. I expected that. Still, we kind of, like, dodged Mammoth Grove. Um... And now we actually dust, dodged Mist of Lityara. If we now can get rid of the pet mate, we can raise the Draugr for both wolves. And let's start with... Yeah, let's start with Harald. Found the Finn. Do I play the Finn? Nah, I think I still have to set up for the shadow. And we're not attacking. Yep. So I'm guessing if I play Torgrid's shadow here, they're probably going to throw away uh, like one, uh, the Scorn Effigy and the Sentinel here. I'm still wondering what the last card in their hand could be. It's... It's not a counter spell, I think. Mm, 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 mm. So do I need six mana right now? Six mana would allow me to play Torgrid Shadow alongside with Finn. So I think that might actually be worth it. Yep. Let's start with the Shadow. I'm probably sacri just sacrificing Wielder and Packmate here. Yep. Kept the Raven in play. Kind of what we expected, of course. We're gonna hit with Harald. And then I'm gonna put the Finn out. Next turn I could go raise the Draugr to get both pack mates back. And play one of them. Yep, bind the monster as their last card. <clears throat> yeah, now that they sacrificed the land to make an additional flyer, I'm probably gonna have to play Recluse. Yep. No real way around it. Um, doesn't really matter, but say for green. And we're still attacking with Harold. That's quite alright. Ending the turn. Because I want to use Raise the Draugr in their turn. 
so they want me to kill the 3 3. But you know, that's actually fine by me. Let's get these pack mates back. Mm, start by playing one of them. And I'll just attack with Harald. No reason not to. Play the Berserker as well. Mm hmm. Koma. Wow. That's, um. Whoa. So I have to play something like Kennel Master here. No real other way around it, I think. So I could. I could also go Mentor Pack Mate. So then I get three more creatures into play. If I attack right now, he's probably gonna block these two and take three, go to six. I have a 3-2 left, I get another 3-2, a 1-1 one, one, and another 3-3. Three, three. He gets another 3-3 three, three and probably loses nothing. So that's not good enough. We're gonna go like this. Because this way, even if he double blocks a Herald or anything else, this one dies. That was the whole idea behind it. I also could have bu buffed the pack mate and forced him to double block on Harold, but me. This is actually quite alright. Gonna sack it. Yeah, you can make that indestructible. Minor too! Just gonna foretell the pet mate. So if they hit with the flyer, uh, do they die? I think if they don't have an additional creature, we have the win. Mm, they do have an additional creature. But wait, we don't know. Mate, we still win, right? So play this. He can't do anything about it. Decline. We target the pack mate. So now he would have actually... He actually needed to sacrifice one of his uh, serpents. To tap my one of my uh, t -t -t to tap the creature, the pack mate here that was equipped, and then he would have lived. Right now he has to like double block ev my both my menace creatures, and he can't block these then. So he actually lost by attacking with his flyer. He's figuring it out. Good game. You can get a good game back. It was a good game indeed. Got to beat Koma. That's pretty big if you ask me. Koma is probably like one of the strongest cards in Limited. Especially in Draft here. But we got through it. Bam! Nice. It is what it is. Uh, this hand on the play. Yeah, I think I'm going to keep this. Let's start with a forest. If I draw Swamp, I'm probably playing that over the pathway. Oh. I actually don't mind foretelling Reaper over it. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Playing that next turn, allowing it to attack immediately. It's also a flyer. Works well with Struggle. Colossal Plow. Oh, he's gonna need something to enable that. So I'm guessing he has Ox in his hand as well. Question is if he has, uh, ha, uh, uh, <laughs> has the ox. Oh, it's a war master. Kill that. 
and attack for one extra damage. Yeah. This might actually be a game where the Reaper carries me to victory. No man if I do. He's got a braggart. Yeah. Let's just get the Reaper to victory. Double struggle, nice. It's a Valkyrie! But he can animate the plow. Let's see what happens, right? Does not block. You know, I'm gonna do it like this. Hard cast the pet mate. Keeping the black up, if I draw an untapped land, I can still... There we go. This is why I want the black untapped, to still play Disciple. Keep eyes on your mana, people. Mat matters a lot in this game. So that's a better shield warrior gone. Ah, item verdict, okay. Let's get that creature out of the way if we can. Mm -hmm. Play the Dread Rider. Toski. Nice, okay, but we got the secondary black. Uh, let's just pause. We can do all of this stuff in his turn. There's the ox. If he animates the plow, I'm just gonna play Feed the Serpent on it. I don't want him to gain life. Yep. And here's the serpent. Gonna feed it with your plow. He's got a... He's low on iron in his diet. Can't drain, but look at that. It's enough. Right, six in one. Got a pack made on, to, on turn two to foretell and even play after that. Yeah. I'm actually a bigger fan of this end than I was of the last one. Let's go. Let's give it a shot. A mulligan to six. Play a mountain. Uh, yeah, this time I'm definitely playing it as green. No matter what. For all the cart. We are going to do the same. Foretold another card. I'm feeling like there is a demon bolt among them. Or behold the multiverse. We're gonna play Packmate. You know, let's attack. Who knows, they might just not block because they think we have a trick. There we go. I think I actually play the Recluse here. Land might be becoming an issue here. That's a Calamity Bearer. Crush the weak. <laughs> okay, so they exiled my Recluse. Did find the land. Thank goodness for that. I'm probably just gonna feed the Serpent, the Giant, and attack. There's a squash. Does he have a follow-up? No, he just pumps the Mistwalker. Okay. Let's keep the pressure on. Does he have the Demon Bolt? Is it anything else? What could it actually be then? Yeah. Okay. And just let it happen. Uh, let's start off with Berserker. And then play Finn. You know, if he wants to counter Finn or something, that's quite alright by me. So could that be side coming? It could be. It's a raven form. You know... I don't mind putting it in my graveyard, actually, because we have raised the Draugr. 
drawing two cards here seems pretty decent. Got a few lands. Okay, Kin Seekers. So I think this is one of the moments where I can actually like truly show the power of um, Finn with Struggle for Scamfar. You know, that's pretty these. What do I have with that word now? These, these. These nuts! <laughs> Ugh. I'm actually getting tired of it already. Let's still foretell Shadow. Needed every single bit of mana, so couldn't have played Elder Hall. Yeah, I like it. Whoop! We're not gonna infect him to death in this last game. <laughs> We're probably just gonna beat him to death. That's a pet mate. Do I don't think I need that right now? It's probably good enough to just do this. And then attack with everything. And foretell packmate as well. If they don't concede in the next turn, because I, I don't really know how they're getting like gonna get through this. Mm-hmm. Six infect counters. You know, it's it's like making me think like, uh, can we still go for it? But no, the best we can do actually is like infect and kill him at the same time, and we're just nah. I don't think we're gonna do that. We're just going to win this turn. How about that? Let's play a pack mate. Let's play Tigrid Shadow. So whoever would have said 7-2, you would have been so... Of oh, no, not that one. You would have been so very right. 7-2 is the end result.